Hello everyone, I'm out on another wild camp tonight and uh, I've been in work today, it's Friday the 7th of July 2023 and well I only live just over there so I'm going to walk to my camp tonight so it's kind of like this, well it's the highest peak, the highest point in uh, Thameside which is where I live, I live in the borough of Thameside and uh, in fact that's it over there look see if you, I don't know if you can see that I'll just pan round can you see I don't know there's a big a big pointed or oh, big it's that up there that big hill up there look see and it, it's called Wild Bank and it's the highest point in Thameside and it's about 400 meters I think it's 399 meters officially so 400 meters or so you know but uh, i'm setting off from bank top so it's going to be bank top to wild bank so i'm going to walk there i'm going to find a place and i'm going to pitch and then just enjoy the evening really i mean it's beautiful look at it it's it's blue sky there's a few clouds around it's it's lovely so i'm hoping for a lovely sunset and a lovely sunrise so and my aim is to to camp on all the peaks all around this area really so last week i, I camped on harridge pike and uh, I've, got, I've got to do hartshead pike yet there's another place called huff hill huff hill that's another, there's a trig point on there as well there's a trig point on this one as well um i'll probably do maybe uh there's another place, Werneth Low, that's probably over that way sort of thing, that's another one I might camp on, so my aim is to camp on all these peaks, I've done, I've done, um, I've done over near Dove Stones, I've done, I've done, uh, what's it called now, near Pots and Pans, I did Alderman's Hill, you might have seen that one, that was uh, all about freedom, uh, that was last year in October on Armistice Day, and uh, yeah, anyway, I'll stop waffling and, and I need to crack on really because it's going to take me about, I'd say, an hour and a half, two hours tops to get up there. So should be still light enough to pitch my tent and then settle in. And then uh, got a couple of beers, no Jaipur tonight, it's a couple of different ones, I'll show you them later, and a bit of whiskey. Uh, I've got a pot noodle, I've had a nice meal anyway, so I'm, I'm not that hungry anyway really, so got some nuts and little snacks chocolate bar so um yeah just uh need to crack on right let's go do they're electrifying all the all the uh, track here so this is like the manchester line to huddersfield and leeds so it's kind of like the they're all diesel engines but they're electrifying the line so it's been going on for the last couple of years and well we're back onto this sort of track so there's been a lot of noise for the last couple of years right so some of the neighbors are a bit pissed off with it but you know you just gotta live with it haven't you progress future and all that eh? is it worth it who knows eh? time will tell right let's go on On the Huddersfield Canal, and I'm just uh, coming into Staley Bridge now. So, get a bit nearer. This is obviously a canal going over the River Tame. Yeah.
but there it is wild bank just coming through the centre of Staley Bridge now some down there barge So there it is, right in front of me. Got to get up that now. I've heard about this Oxford Street chippy. It's also really nice. Next time, eh? Nice bakery. There it is. Wild Bank. Right, so I've just got to get up there now. If I go this way and look back, if you look, that's called Huff Hill. And there's a tree branch up there. You just about to see it. There's like a covered reservoir up there. There's Manchester in the distance. But uh, I'm going to have to do Huff Hill as well now, aren't I? Yeah, so you've got uh, Matley and uh, you've got uh, Mottram up that way. That's where uh, L.S. Lowry lived. And there's a blue plaque on his house. If you, I, don't, I think I've driven past it. I've never actually stopped and had a proper look. But uh, that's not too far that way. And, uh, but yeah, it's the perfect evening. I think it's probably about another... I don't know what time is it now. It's half past eight. There's at least another hour of sunshine. Probably an hour and... 15 minutes, like or at least an hour and 15 minutes before sunset. So um, I've got plenty of time really, I'm not far off the top now. I've got about another 160 metres to do, so it's, it's not a lot. Although it is a bit when you've got all this on your back. Your tent and your bed and your, your sleeping mat and sleeping bag and all the rest of that stuff. I've got a pot of noodles, that weighs a ton. And, uh, Beers and whiskey, although they're no, no Jaipur tonight to change. I'll show you what that is later. But uh, yeah, so Obson Moor, that's the one. Obson Moor up there. And Matley. Yeah, brushes. I've never really had a proper look around the, the brushes reservoir, so I might do that another time. But I might camp on Huff Hill. If, you, if you're feeling a bit uh, peed off, you could have a huff, huff and a puff and keep on Huff Hill maybe, yeah? But, uh, yeah, it's, it's just so still. But, uh, I'll show you, like, there's Manchester there in the distance. Look. You can see Manchester over there. Look at that there, eh? Sun's starting to go down. And you've got, like I say, there's like five ways. There's a path going that way. There's another one up here. And then there's this is where I'm going now, up, uh, up Wild Bank. And that way will take you to um, Hobson Moor and sort of Mottram and that way, really. Right, come on. Let's go. Nice little wooded bit. Didn't expect this. Oh, it's lovely and shaded. Really hot tonight. It's like I think it's about 25 now. Yeah. Whew. Right. Yeah, so the top's just up there now. There's uh Hartshead Pike. Just through the trees. You can see that. It's sort of there, I think, isn't it? Yeah. Just there. Sticking up. There's Manchester, Staley Bridge below us at Ashton. And, uh, so I've got to get up that now. The final hurdle.
Right, starting to climb a bit more now, not far off the top. The views are starting to open up. Look at that, hey? Yeah. Beautiful. You can actually see, uh, there's Harwich Pike, where I was last week. I get a better view from the top. Aye. Yeah, so that there, just see the cairn on top of Harwich Pike where I camped last Thursday. And behind that, you can just see a little mound. That's another cairn on top of Alfin Pike. And I'm going to move to the left, and you can just about see Hartsford Pike there. There it is. And then there's the sun going down. And then to this side here, you got Manchester City Centre. Yeah. Manchester Airport, you might just be able to see it. Let's see, you can just sort of see the lights. There it is, that's Manchester Airport there. And then I've got a I've got the final hurdle. It's always the toughest and the steepest. Oh, Right. So that's Arnfield Reservoir, which is in uh, Tintwistle, or Tinsel as the locals call it. Sun's going down now, beautiful sunset that. There's my tent, all pitched. Aye. Just got to get my bed made up now.
got it windy. Can you hear it? I think it's pretty still, sort of like lower down, but up here, it always is on peaks. Well, usually, anyway. I might get out in a bit and have a look around. All players coming in at Manchester all lights are out, it's lovely. Gonna be up early in the morning, up at sunrise. Hi. I'm enjoying it, it's nice. It's nice to get out on my own, actually. I like it on my own, because you just you don't have to sort of make efforts to converse and entertain or whatever. You know, you, you can just chill out and do what you want. It's nice. You try it, honestly. It's the future. Get out on your own in a tent or a bivy or whatever. Get somewhere remote, a couple of beers, Something to eat, and, and honestly, it's, it's wonderful. Waffling again, isn't I? Mm. Right, um, I might have a look around on the trick point again because all the lights are out now and the planes are coming in over the top. It's a bit blowy, but uh, yeah, I might have a little, little look around and then uh, I'll see it morning. Hopefully, we have a really nice sunrise. It's a bit windy. Oh. So we'll have a look outside. We're getting a nice sunrise.
that back down now. That's all camp that. Whoops. Right, yeah, so hope you like that. Hope you enjoyed that. So, uh, thanks for watching. See you on the next one. You can just say hello. Yeah. Morning. Hey. Aren't you lovely? Hey. Hey. Yeah. Aren't you? A lot of flies, isn't they? Hey. A lot of flies. Got an out for you though. No apples, nothing. Hey. Yeah. Hi. See you later. Enjoy your day. Hey. There we are, full circle, back to the starting point. So, yeah, it was, uh, it was up there last night. Nice little camp, that. And what a lovely morning. See you again. <laughs>